Hallo allemaal en welkom bij een nieuwe video. Mijn naam is Christina Polymok en welkom bij Quarantaine Dag 104. Vandaag gaan we weer verder met uh, stories. En of met episodes, zo heet het bepalen. En vandaag gaan we weer met Pretty Little Lies verder. Episode 2, dus laten we beginnen. Still missing Alison Diller. Diller, want is. Ali never came back. From once all of Rosewood searched. But Ali left us nothing to find. Oh yeah, volgens mij vanwege die storm of zo. People were starting to lose, lose hope that she would ever return. But me, I wasn't so sure. Because I couldn't shake this feeling that Ali was still out there. And that she knew the secret I had hidden in my luck. I don't know, but it's so good in angles. The night... At Spanish Brown was one of the worst of my life, but it was also the night I made the best friends I'll ever have. <coughs> Ali's secrets brought us together, but it was our own secret secrets that would keep us close close forever. Uh, Hannah stopped overeating and got really into fashion, but that led to a new bad habit shoplifting. I was so the we were busted her from Mona to ja, dat ga ik niet even. Ik ben eigenlijk niet goed in Engels. Nice scarf. Ali was right about Spencer going after her sister's boyfriend. Her sister got... Ja, yeah, daar. How uh, he actually like you. Spencer wasn't the only one hiding a relationship. I was too, but hers was a whole different story. Right now I'm thinking I want to major in English. Because I can escape it. My friends always call me the artsy one. What about you? Just graduated actually. I'm starting my first teaching job this semester. Aria and Ezra move fast once they met. But nothing could prepare for what happened next. Welcome to English 201. I'm Mr. Fitz. <laughs> Oh no. And Emily became really close with Maya, the girl who moved into Ali's house after her parents packed up and left. Are you ready to tell your mom about us? She doesn't need to know everything about me. These were the kind of secrets that were never meant to come out, but one by one they did. Nice shades, Hannah. Do, do they let you bring extra surprises in? Poor Spencer always wants her sister's boyfriend, but remember if you kiss, I tell. Well, aren't you the teacher's pet? What would your parents think about your new man? Hey, um, did you at least get out a goodbye kiss? He is one for me, so. And I. And I didn't forget about me. Who knew a secret so big could fit inside a locket so small? Be a shame if Brian found out what you've been hiding. You know, the old was texting us. And the trees were getting worse. Um, you okay? A is ruining my life. Uh, what did she do now? He said she'd tell my mom about Maya that we kissed. Okay, this is getting out of control. I'm calling the girls. We need to start fighting back. Okay, guys, who the hell is A? I don't know, but she's starting to do more than just treating me. She told my sister I kissed Ren, which isn't, isn't even true. He kissed me. Come on, I can be the only one thinking this as Ellie ran and all over it. She was always messing with our heads. And now it's like she's making up for lost time or something. And uh, Ellie's gone. 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 It's been a year. We don't know that Aria, they never found a body. Look, I don't really care who A is. All that matters is that we hunt her down and stop her. Oh no. Can I go here? You all get this. Yep. Well, isn't this precious? Five little lies all together. You want to know who I am? I follow the guy in green. What? 
the what's guy in green over there? Oh my god, that's Brian Burr, my Brian from Riverbank. What? Okay, this is freaking me out. He's cuter than ever. <laughs> did a did a really did a already get to him? Isabel. Oh um. Oh my god, Brian. Okay, Isabel, we go well, well, well. Fancy meeting you here. Hey, shouldn't that be my line? I'm the one who lives in Rosewood after all. Man, I can't believe it's been a year. How are you? How am I? I'm nowhere near over you. Uh, be sweet. I'm great. It's amazing to see you, but I think I know why you're here. Oh, man, who told you? Um, what? I just moved here. Remember my own from Rosewood? I'm staying with her for a while. Oh, wow, that's great. You look amazing. We have to take a Rian. Selfie. I'll make our friends back home so jealous. Okay, sure. Ready? What's so funny? Do I look queer? No, you look beautiful, but your friend over there looks pretty funny. That was fun. Go to home, hi. So Brian made you just decide to move to Rosewood. There's nothing else that brought you here. I really hope he had nothing to do with this. I hear I could find you here. I'd love to talk to you. It's important. Shoot, I have to go on my own. own. Meet me there later. After you don't meet your friends. We'd have to place to ourselves. Of course, let me just finish up here and I'll meet you there. Awesome. Hey, also, I got invited to this party and was Kane's house tonight. Are you going? Um, yeah, she's going. Ah, oh, great. I get to hang with you twice in one day. That's a good start. Really, um, what Ellie said to follow the guy in green, who, by the way, is hot. Nice work, Isabel. He is hot. I forgot it just how hot. But he's just a friend. Then how come you're smiling like that? Isabel, this is huge. Maybe you guys can finally be together. Maybe are we just right? Maybe Brian and I can eat. And finally start over. Okay, back to business. Ellie said to follow the guy in green and he's going to Noah's party. Then Buck says that's where Ellie makes her dramatic re return. That will be such an Ellie move. So wait, we're going to we're going tonight? Of course we're going. But that's exactly what A wants. Yeah, I feel like we should talk about Not again. I won't be the only special guest at Noel's party. Family that tonight, pretty little liars, or all your ugly little truths will come out. Does everyone get this? Yeah, I thought Ali was the ugly girl before, but this is next level. Guess we have to go. I find her and make her stop. Spence is right, we're going to the party. Hey Isabel, hey, nice place. Come on, let's go upstairs. So this is what it's like to be alone with Brian in his bedroom. I wonder what he has to tell me. Be direct, direct. So why did you ask me here? I wanted to see you. It's about Lisa. What about her? Things have gotten bad. The doctor says if she's not waking up. Oh my. I told her goodbye, not like she could hear me. What changed? Nothing. That's the problem. She's not going to get better. <coughs> Remember the days when it was just the three of us before we grew up and feelings got in the way? Of course I do. Things were so simple. We were in step back then. Now I feel like I woke up from a dream. Suddenly it was just me alone in the hospital room. At least I'm so sorry I wasn't there for you. You're here now. I mean it being with you, it makes me feel so much better. Good. So I have to ask, are you seeing anyone here? Like dating, definitely not. Good. I've missed you so much. Me too, every day I want to pick up the phone and call you. What's so funny? Eh? I was so nervous about this. And all either of us had to do, do was send a text. We're ridiculous. I'm glad you came to Rosewood. Me too. So what now? We see where things go between us. Okay, I, I like that, Isabel. Yeah. I'm really glad you came over. Me too. And if we're being honest, I should have told you how I really feel a few years ago. Now that you're here in my bedroom, all I can think about is kissing you. Brian, you go. <laughs> Rip. Shoot. 
She's going to be pissed if she finds you in here. I could sneak out the window. I really don't want to say goodbye to you. Goodbye yet. How about we are on the roof? That sounds fun. It has an awesome view. And maybe I can get that kiss. Should I go to the roof goodbye? I need that of mine. <laughs> I'd love to, but I should probably get going. That's too bad. But thanks, goodness, for the last party. I can't wait to see you again. Same here. I need to perfect that for the last party tonight. Can you wear a bedje van me? I picked out something for you and your friends, little liar. Girls like you should always be dressed to kill. What the? Wait, that dress was definitely not in my closet this morning. Anna, did you get the dress from A2? Yeah, are you gonna wear it? Already have it on. The dress is super hot. Oh yeah, Spence and Emily are wearing it too. Okay, let me try it on. How do you spook it? I can't meet Anna. Sorry, this dress is hot. Am I gonna meet Anna? Look, that's well. I love it, you leave and like your closet. You can change your outfit at any time in the closet on the bottom left on Joy. So you can keep me from that party. You are not going to that party. Don't you think I know what goes on at Noel's current parties? But the answer is no, that please. You're not being fair. You said Rosa would be a fresh start. Don't you trust me? How can you ask me that after you drove us out of Riverbank? Are you going to keep punishing me for that I forever? Go to your room. I refuse to be spoken to this way. <coughs> this is so unfair. Spencer is about to go to David Bryan. It was really good, but Spencer made that one. Let me go to Noel's. What? Why? He's being ridiculous. He says it. It's, oh my god, Spence, I gotta go. Oh my god, come and get me. When that closes our door, I open a window. See you at the party. Oh my god. Oh, dit was het deel al. Um, ja, ja. Dan sluit bij deze ook de video af voor vandaag. En dan zie ik je morgen bij Quantana dag 105. Bye.